Next question here from Jail. Thanks for joining. Do you have any recommendations for tools and applications that can help me sync data from our Google shared drives to a local server? We're currently working solely off Google Drive. Look, my recommendation would be, I mean, I, I challenge on, I challenge you on why you might want to do that. The most, the most basic way of doing that would be to set up something like a, a headless Mac or a headless NAS drive and just tick the available offline box so it all gets downloaded to that machine. And then everyone, you know, sets up a local share to that machine and then it's only kind of downloaded once in your office, right? But, you know, we're really moving away from that style of working these days because most countries, most economies have pretty decent internet connections. Most businesses now can get a fiber connection. And even if you've got five or 10 or 15 or 20 people in one office, Google file, what was called Google file stream is now just called Google Drive. It's all been wrapped up in the Google Drive. It's pretty darn efficient with its use of uploading and downloading bandwidth constraints. But if you are in a location or an economy or just a particular suburb or office that doesn't have a great internet connection, you may consider that. There are certain NAS drives, which are you know locally attached storage, uh, sorry, network attached storage, which will allow you to synchronize some files from Google Drive down there. The challenge is, and this is why I try and avoid them, is anytime you add some kind of third-party synchronization app or third-party synchronization service, you include the potential risk that there may be double ups and synchronization conflicts. The sync might stop working and so you might think it's being backed up, but it's not actually being backed up. Uh, you can then end up with people working on different versions of the same file. And it's the kind of thing where it turns into a really, really big mess before someone realizes and then you have a oh shoot moment. And I'd rather have ahas than oh shoots in life. Uh, and so for me, my strong recommendation is to just stick with the Google Drive app. Maybe be smart about you know when you're downloading the files. If you need to put files into a particular job folder and you know only download the active jobs down to your computer, and then you've got those accessible locally on your machine, uh, and then you can avoid having to have a shared network resource for the office. That would be my strong recommendation. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this content. And if you need more help with your Google Workspace account, there's four ways that we can help. Number one, join our free community group where others in the community help support each other with the Google Workspace accounts. And I'm in there from time to time answering questions as well. Number two, take advantage of our free transfer in offer to get a bunch of additional value for your Workspace account just for transferring your billing over to IT Genius. Number three, you can take advantage of a free consultation if you qualify or an IT systems check and audit for everything technology in your business. Number four, if you need help right now, you can either join our concierge program or book a one-time fix-it service to get support from our professional support team for everything Workspace and the Google ecosystem. See you in the next one.